Good evening everybody, welcome back to my channel Lady Likeables, thank you so much for tuning in and I hope you enjoy my video. Uh, I'm going to do another video of meals of the week or what's for tea um, and I thought I'd start on a Sunday seeing as I finish work at 6 uh, and I can do um, a really nice tea with things that are really fancy and take some time over it. So Sunday night, the first meal of the week is three Yorkshire puddings. I've bought a new Yorkshire pudding tin, it's not really a Yorkshire pudding tin, I think it's like a tiny little bunt tin but gluten free Yorkshire puddings are really hard to make and I wanted the hole in the middle to make them a bit lighter. I'm not sure if they've gone like that, they're more like a savoury cake but anyway they'll be tasty. And on top of that I've got a gluten free beef gravy which has got a little bit of horseradish sauce in the gravy as well because I love horseradish. I've done some honey roasted parsnips, I've done some roast potatoes which were both done in the air fryer, um, I parboiled those to make them a bit softer, squirted some oil over them and then covered them in um, polenta because that makes it a little bit crispy and that's gluten free as well. I've got carrots, two tiny little sausages because I really didn't fancy any meat at all but I've got two sausages. And then the white gloopy bit is uh, bread sauce. I really fancied some homemade bread sauce. I've made an effort and uh, done that. And then the sauce over there is horseradish. I actually wanted some cranberry sauce to go with this meal, but I can't find it. And the same as it's a Sunday night and I'm not working for the rest of the evening, I've got a strawberry daiquiri, which I got in my food hall the other day. So that is a Sunday night roast dinner. Hi, so tea tonight is something that I'm not sure if it's a British tradition, I don't, really don't know. But I've got an unsmoked gammon steak, which I've just done with one mushroom. I actually have three, but they were starting to burn, so I ate two of them. Um, I've opened a can of pineapple slices, so I did those under the grill with the juices of the gammon. So they've caught a little bit, but that's fine. Um, some good old English mustard. I live on mustard, I could eat it by the spoonful. Uh, and then what I've got there is called rumple thumps. So it's basically bubble and squeak, but with loads of cheese in it. So cheese in the mashed potato and then put on top of it and put under a hot grill or in the oven or something. So you, this is a great way of using all your bits and pieces up in the fridge. So it's mashed potato, broccoli, cabbage, onion, and carrots uh, and in there I also put some whole grain mustard salt and pepper um, to make it really really tasty so yeah I'm really looking forward to this I'm absolutely starving so that's tea tonight tea tonight is something probably a little bit strange to most people but I guess that's the beauty of living on your own is that you can have whatever you feel like so I've made a sandwich or half a sandwich with two slices of bread um, it's got brie cranberry jelly lettuce and I've sliced up some grapes in there and that's one of my favourite sandwiches. I've got three little hot chipolata sausages which are gluten free. I've made a homemade coleslaw so it's just carrot, mayonnaise, onion and cabbage and then some buttered minted new potatoes so a bit of a strange tea but it's just what I fancied. Tea tonight is a beef stroganoff, it's homemade, I don't think it's the best, it's thin strips of beef, um, finely sliced mushrooms, cream, paprika, some garlic, some tomato puree and there's a little dash of brandy or two in there. Um, so I've done rice with peas and broccoli so I don't think this is the best beef stroganoff that I've ever made but it's kind of made in a hurry and I think it tastes okay. So it's tea time again and I've made a really, really simple salad because it's after 20 past 11 and it's very, very late so I don't want anything really heavy. So I've just got one of the spreadable creamy cheese squares, I've got some grated carrots, some lettuce, some rocket, um, sliced tomato, um, gluten-free bread which is smothered in low pack because I love my low pack and some shrimps and prawns. Um, the prawns or the shrimps have got fresh lemon juice on it. And then I've done some homemade tzatziki dressing, which is all right. It's quite nice for homemade, but um, I don't think it's quite the same as the shop-bought things. But I don't want to eat processed shop-bought things. I try and make everything myself, so that is my tea tonight. Tea tonight is a caprese stuffed mushrooms. So it's just one of the large mushrooms that I took the stalk out of. Um, use the stalk and cut it up into like fine breadcrumbs. 
Um, I took all the dark quills out of there to stop it from going black when the juices run out, when the water runs out. So it's got no quills in there, so it's just like a, a hard base. Uh, and then I've rubbed it in garlic butter, the bottom and the top as well. And then inside there's some basil leaves, some cream cheese and garlic cream cheese. Um, and then it's got mozzarella pearls on there. Uh, and it's got cherry tomatoes on there. I've smothered that in balsamic vinegar as well. And then to go along with that, it's just a really simple salad of rocket tomatoes, grated carrot, grated cheese, celery. Um, I think that's it, yeah, in balsamic vinegar. So that is tea tonight. So tea tonight is a homemade chili. Um, so I've made it with jasmine rice, which is lovely. Uh, and then my meaty bit in the middle is part beef, part pork. Um, there's a red onion in there, there's lots of chilli, habanero chilies, and I know this is really spicy and really hot, that's why I've done a little salsa. Um, there's mushrooms, there's fresh tomatoes, there's loads of garlic, there's oregano, um, a few other herbs and bits and pieces. It's been in my slow cooker for most of the night uh, and then it's switched off at 9 o'clock so it's kind of been stewing and festering and getting really hot. And then I did a homemade mango salsa, which is just tomatoes, onions, garlic, lime juice, mango. Um, I didn't have any cilantro. I think you're supposed to put that in, um, but I didn't have any. But it's really, really nice. So hopefully that will cool the heat of my chilli down. Tea tonight is a unsmoked gammon steak that I got in my food haul the other day. They're £1.49 for two. Um, they are very nice, however, they are very salty, which I don't actually like, so I've rinsed it under the tap. I'm not sure whether you're supposed to do that, but they were very, very salty. Uh, I've got a lightly fried egg, which I did in the same oil as the gammon steak. And then the potato -y thing is either potato mayonnaise, gratin or dauphinoise, I'm not too sure. But I thinly sliced um, a couple of potatoes, boil them up in milk with some onion garlic, salt, a little bit of mustard, boil them up for about eight or nine minutes till they went a little bit soft, um, put a load of spinach in the milk and then put them in a Pyrex dish. Added a lot of cheese to the top and then cooked it for about 20 minutes on fairly high so the potatoes are cooked. They're all creamy, garlicky, oniony kind of thing uh, and then I've got some good old English mustard so that's my Saturday night tea. So with that being the end of the week, I'm going to wish you a goodbye. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you like my videos, please push the big red button, leave a comment, give me a big thumbs up and hope to see you all again soon.